you uh, uh, yeah. teach the kid about drinking liquor and throwing dice? Yeah, no, not not this trip yet. But what about yeah. the birds and the bees? Mm. <laughs> He's too young for that. Is he? <laughs> yeah, ten. Well, never too young. Never too young. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Dubai they they let kids lose their virginity to hookers well, very young. Well, I I lost mine when I was twelve. So yeah. So when so he's ten right now. Yeah. In two years, you think years. about you, will yeah. you pull the trigger on it. I always thought about it. It's like, you know, do I go and hire him a hooker just for the sake yes. of Hire him a hooker? Yes. The answer yes. is yes. yes. When yes. you think that, when you yes. think to yourself, do I go ahead and hire him a hooker? The answer is yes. Yeah. Anthony Kiedis, uh, his dad, let Anthony Kiedis, the rock star from the Red Hot Chili Peppers, when Anthony Kiedis was like 14 or 15, let him lose his virginity to one of Anthony Kiedis' dad's girlfriends. Nice. What? And he just... That's and fatherly look, he turned love out well. right there. He turned out pretty he well. Turned out pretty well. He's yeah. dude. He's one of the all time pussy outs. Yeah. He's sort of yeah. like Baron too. Anthony Kiedis, I think, is in his sixties now, and he just he goes even harder than Leo DiCaprio. Actually, yeah, he does because his chicks are always in their teens, and mm. he's and I'm not hating on Mr. Yeah. Kiedis. Mr. Kiedis is he's fucking. Her. You write a song like Scar Tissue, which you know I guess he didn't really write that song, but well, you know, under the bridge. It? Under the bridge. Yeah, you gotta give he wrote props. under the bridge. He wrote the lyrics to it. Yeah, that's amazing. Yeah. You gotta yeah, give props to the real man is Hefner. Hugh? Hefner, yeah, Hugh is is a man. It's the guy I I would want to be. Hugh, uh, yeah, man. Look, he, uh, I mean, into his seventies, like you had to bang him every week if yeah. you were living at the mansion. And yeah. there were how many chicks there, bro? I mean, he was killing it. And he would not let them leave the mansion yeah. past six p.m. <laughs> And they had to watch Charlie Chaplin movies. Dude, all I, yeah, I, I I did a podcast with one of the uh, uh, the play girls who just had her book come out, and she was telling me the craziest things. The sisters, the twins. Hey, tell us some stories. What, the, the, the twins. Do the twins. It, so he's an OG pimp. First, you should have stood up and slapped them and been like, "How dare you? How dare you she, desecrate the name of Hugh Hefner after he has passed?" She wrote a whole book, did a whole thing. Dude, they they canceled him. Right. Bull- I know, and well, he didn't. So he made one of the chicks. Suck a German Shepherd's dick, right? I, mean, I didn't I hear heard that. that. I heard two sisters got got it on though. That's two twin sisters, crazy. He made him? them. He made them. That's like eat each other's them. pussies. Yeah. Oh yeah. Dude, oh, I don't know about made. Because he did not make them. The, Those chicks. The end, of, end of the day, there's no. a negotiation in progress. Of course, yeah. They and wanted then, money. And hey, yes, yes. You exactly. like being television stars? Yeah. 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 You yeah. like driving around exactly. in that Bentley? You know, just fuck. We all have choices. You like your sister's pussy? Yeah. Yeah. You like it? We all have choices. These girls are fucking. These girls are hookers that transmuted the oldest profession into stardom, and they should be so thankful. They should install a titanium dildo at Hugh Hefner's mausoleum, and these chicks should go by weekly to suck it. it it's okay? wild how like they, they should not be canceling that right. great man. No, it's wild. Like you said, he's the OG pimp. A bronze know? dick, like, titanium. What would it be? Okay, a titanium, it's titanium penis and they on the it? mausoleum, and they they just how how long do they have to suck they it? They have to suck it. There should be his ashes. His ashes should be mixed in. With like uh, a viscous, maybe egg yolks. No. And I think an engineer should well, come they need and a ring on it every day. Sure. <laughs> and I think you should have to suck it until the penis ejaculates egg yolk and a, a little bit of Hughes ashes. Yeah. Okay. Into their mouth. Oh my god! And uh, how many? What'd you say? And how long would it take one of these women to do? You this? know, it's up to the engineer that day. Oh my god! He could pull a little. He pulls a little rope. Like, you know, in the cartoons when they have a gun that's in the hallway and they want to shoot somebody, like they pull the fucking, yeah, he's got like a little, he's got a little string that attaches to a, a pulley and he just goes, dink. And, you know, sometimes it's one minute, sometimes it's an hour, sometimes, sometimes for a laugh, Hugh's not coming that day. He's going to make one of the playmates go for hours. You're in, telling me it's in three in the morning. Graveyard, yeah. It's three in the morning. Yeah. And this guy's going to let it roll. I don't you think those women deserve it after all they got from you after? Trust me, I I uh listen, as a sex worker myself, you know what I mean? Sure mom might have paid me, blow me one time. Oh my god, it was so hard on no it wasn't. It was uh very easy to do. I know I'm a male, oh but I know we're supposed to be equal though. So I got my cock sucked. A woman paid me to suck it. And you know what? I'm I'm not gonna write a book. About her when she dies and se- and and cancel, <laughs> cancel her. her right. I'm gonna tell her right now. Guess how many nights of sleep I've lost because of that? Zero. Yeah. You know what I mean? Z- zero. I mean, yeah, dude. It's just how much did she pay you? Five hundred bucks, dude. 
I mean, well, the thank you. I know, Jesse. I know. Power that they don't I know. Need. Well, it's just these. It's, I mean, once a hooker, always a hooker. And these chicks were clearly fucking skanks from the start. And what do skanks do? Skanks want to get more money and yeah. more attention. Oh, yeah. But they've already got the implants. They've already got the fake eyelashes. What's the next move to get attention? Uh, it's like, I don't want to be there. I had to eat my sister's pussy. Cry me a river. Eating I, your sister. Go to the graveyard and suck the titanium dildo. I think, uh, you would be, could you, would you be the liaison of that? Like, like you have to go and visit them once or twice a year to remind them that their quota of sucking the cock, it hasn't really been reached. Yes, I will. <laughs> and I will do it in a vampire costume. You can't, you, can't, you, can't you can't say you did it against your will without a gun to your head. It's the way I look at it. Yeah. Right. You don't have a gun to your head and that's you a choose to point. do it. Yes. And that's your choice. Yeah. Dude, they they yeah. know what they're getting into. They're yeah. willingly exactly. doing these things. They're willingly getting into willingly doing So what are we going to do? We're going to cancel to OnlyFans because OnlyFans gave these girls platforms to do diabolical things to themselves. Yeah. Like it's the same oh, yeah. concept, right? Like you chose to log in, you chose to do those things. We're not going to cancel the, yes. the platform because they made you do it. No, you made yourself do it. I mean, they showed know? it in a movie, which I thought was odd. It's like uh, there's a good point because I mean, like in a uh, Baby Reindeer, very famous series that's going on, on Netflix, the guy gets raped in it by a man, and what he the first time he hangs out oh, with I the didn't guy, I know they made a show about my life. <laughs> Your documentary. I was the guy who raped him. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> they show. OK, so the first time he hangs out with the guy, the guy kind of like gives him like something that makes him real woozy. Mm -hmm. And then he tries to put a finger up his ass. Mm -hmm. And the guy's like, whoa, that's my like, playbook. Whoa, man. Like, what's good? To no, yeah. I'm leaving Dinner first, please. He came back about five times after that. Right, the guy yeah, tried yeah. to finger your ass. Right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, dinner was good. But dinner, yeah, he did love the dinner and yeah, the drinks. Exactly. And the guy had some status and he wanted some exactly. a hookup. It's BS. You know, some people will Don't say that boy, they're putting a pill in a guy's drink is a little problematic. I won't. I think yeah. that's fine. I'm joking. <laughs> I, I think that would have been fine if the guy didn't. Okay, Bill Cosby. No, no, he uh, he he didn't like. So, he, yes, but he survives. He doesn't let the guy like completely finger his asshole. He survives that. And after getting so drugged the pinky. and then comes back, I'm like, why would he come back? Because it was just the pinky. Yeah, like the butthole just, stuff. <laughs> yeah, it was just the pinky. It's just the pinky. Yeah. No, I, I don't know if any of you guys have been outside the Playboy Mansion. It's I'm pretty sure the one with a bunch of like weird children sculptures out on the lawn. It's on Sunset Boulevard. It's in it's right by Westwood, UCLA. That is I. I often tell myself i will die happy if i die within like you know a mile or two of ucla because that's the most beautiful real estate on earth Dude, you know they got tunnels down there right they who the jews uh, uh i don't i don't know about the jews but they they got tunnels whoever they are the the elite oh they yeah, got tunnels sure. they, they got tunnels do. running to those mansions and stuff like i that bet well. there are some yeah. Like, if there's a nuclear holocaust, the people in Bel Air, of all people, probably have some escape hatches. Have you ever heard of the Getty? The Getty? There, yeah. There's like a there's like a The bunker Getty down Villa? There. Yeah. There, uh, no, the one. Uh, the museum. Yeah, the museum. There's yeah, like the a, Getty Villa. It's a famous the museum. one by Malibu. Well, yes. there's two. There's two. There's yeah. the Getty Villa and then the Getty Museum, oh, okay. museum yeah, yeah, which yeah, yeah. is, uh, it's. The by UCLA, right yeah. by yeah, LA. Yeah, yeah. So the the yeah. Getty Museum is by UCLA. The Getty Villa is beautiful. The same yeah. person, yeah, yeah. Who, who made both. Okay, yeah. so there's a tunnel under the Getty. That's yeah. That's what that's what I hear. There's tunnels. Uh, okay, yeah. I that's I mean. Well, good. you know, the Mormons have like like when apocalypse comes, the Mormons have like years and years of food storage. Really? Like, so if you're a part of the I, Mormons, you got to specify. You have, that. I knew a Mormon kid in high school named Nick. All he had was acne and a pot habit. I don't Once? think. No, I don't yeah. think he had four Once, years uh, of food under his house. Must you I'm name talking everybody? About the, I'm talking first about and last it. name. Must you? <laughs> must you name everyone first and last? Am name? I supposed to cut those out? First? You, no, no, can no. Can you no, cut but, his last name? Yeah, 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 yeah that one. Yeah, that he did cut, struggle with that. I think the, it's cleared up. I'm talking about the church in general. Can you cut that, Jesse? Yeah, I'm talking about the church in general. They have because of my. One of my best friends who growing up in Hawaii, his dad's a bishop at the Mormon church. And I they actually, the church itself has food storages when this shit happens. Like, so their people will be taken care of for like for years. So.